wild game and stuff, and he liked it. You know, they was eating lawfully. They weren't eating no fucking wild boar or some shit like that. Keep reading. And Jacob sought his pottage, and Esau came from the field, and he was faint. And he was faint. That, that goes back to that weak nature. Okay? Esau was out hunting. He got tired. While Jacob was in the house making food, he was cooking, keep reading. And Esau said to Jacob, feed me, I pray thee, with that same red pottage, for I am faint. Therefore was his name called Edom. His name was called Edom, which means red, out of Wong in the Hebrew. Now the reason why he was called red outside of his appearance was that that meat or the pottage, it wasn't fully cooked. It still had blood in it. And that's another characteristic to show that you so-called white people are Edomites. You love bloody meat. They call it juicy. Because I worked with this Edomite and we was talking about steak. And we got steaks at, at the Mexican restaurant or whatever. And um, the, the guy that was cooking it, he came out and he was like, Oh, John, how you want your uh, fajita meat or your steak or whatever? I was like, I want that shit burnt, man. I don't want no blood in it, no pink. Just burnt that shit. I don't care. I got sauce. I'll put it on there. The dude was like, you don't want it to be kind of red or pink. It's still juicy like that. You know, I like it juicy. I was like, I don't like blood, man. Then the dude said, I like my women like I like my steak. Bloody and all that. Well, he'll eat a mite, but that's nasty, man. But that's how Esau get down. And that proves that you so-called white people, that's how you operate. And even your society proves that you're Edomites too, because just like your forefather couldn't wait for the food to be cooked, he was impatient. That's how you people are in this society. Everything instant. Somebody come up here to ask this question. These Edomites, they won't. They don't let you. They don't have the patience for you to go through the uh, the precepts to break down your point. They just want a quick answer. You know, everything's microwave. Everything's quick. You people have no patience. Okay. Keep reading. Just like Esau, he couldn't wait for the food to be cooked, so he ate it raw. Keep reading. And Jacob said, "Sell me." This day thy birthright, and Esau said, said, Behold, I am at the point to die. At the point to die. And, and you so-called white people are dramatic, man. That's why we call you hypocrites. Okay? You're a bunch of actors, man, by, by birth. Okay? And what prophet shall this birthright do to me? Now, what was the birthright? We just read it. It's the kingdom of heaven. So in his mind, he was like, man, I'm about to die. That show, that show he didn't have no faith in the Heavenly Father. He trusted in his own strength. Because that's what he was, he was, uh, he was trusting in. He wanted to fill his stomach, man. To regain his strength. Not, oh, well, I'll, I'll, have, I'll wait the Lord. He, he'll uh, keep me alive. So he didn't care about the birthright. Keep reading. And Jacob said, swear to me this day. And he swore unto him. And he sold his birthright unto Jacob. Oh my God, that's Jacob over there doing the gangland stuff. Then Jacob gave Esau bread and pottage of lentils, and he did eat and drink and rose up. Yeah. And when he was his, his way, thus Esau despised his birthright. Thus Esau, Esau despised his birthright, which his birthright was going to have total rulership over the whole earth forever. But he despised it. Dog barking at the place. And he sold it. And he sold his birthright, man. Now go back, go back to about Esau in uh chapter 27 about his king. Okay? It's, it's Jake doing the gangland style. She's getting all into it. Keep reading. Uh 40. Genesis chapter 28, verse. 40. Yeah. And by thy work and by thy sword shall I live. Well go up some, go up some, go up some. Because we want to get where Esau start crying because he, he Jacob got blessed. Genesis chapter 27 verse 30. And it came to pass as soon as Isaac had made an end of blessing Jacob. So we, we understand the blessing is the kingdom of heaven. Having the nation serve you and bow down to you, and your mother's your mother's son 
be your servant. Fulfilling the prophecy that the Lord had spoke of prior to the children ever being born. So this is important. Alright? To know who the kingdom of heaven is going to. It's going to you Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Not anybody else. Nobody else can have part in that. Okay? That's a Jake, baby. Jake. <laughs> <laughs> and it came to pass as soon as Isaac had made it in of blessing Jacob. Yeah. And Jacob was yet scarce gone out yeah. from his presence of Isaac his father, that Isaac his brother came in from his honey. Oh Esau. Esau. Esau his brother. Keep reading. Yeah, Esau his brother came in from his honey. And he was this this is what that was in his spirit to hunt. He loved it. Just like these so-called white people love hunting. Keep reading. And he also had mates savory meat and brought it to his father and said unto his father, let, let my father rise and eat of his son's vintage, venison. Venison. That I that my soul may bless him. I, man, I bet you Esau had this super duper proud look on his face, man. He just knew it. Because his father didn't know he sold his birthright, man. His father didn't know he sold his birthright. So he thought he could get over on his on his father. Which the Heavenly Father knew he was going to sell his birthright because he put that in his spirit to do that. Ain't no such thing as free will. He made Esau faint to desire raw meat to go off and then to sell his birthright. So now he about to get the ant ant. Okay, keep reading. And Isaac, his father, said unto him, Who art thou? And he said, I am thy father. I am thy son, thy firstborn Esau. And Isaac trembled with very exceedingly and said, Who were who were lucky, who were he that had taken venison and brought it to me? And I have eaten all of all of it before thou cometh uh -huh. came of it, and have blessed him, yea, and he shall be blessed. He shall be blessed. He shall be blessed. That's right. That was Jacob. Not everybody. That's not Ham. Not the descendants of Ham. It wasn't the Japhites. And it wasn't the rest of the people of Shem. Okay. Alright. It was Abraham, Isaac, and then it went to Jacob. He is blessed. And he shall be blessed. Keep reading. And when Esau heard... The words of his father, he cried with a great and exceeding bitter cry. Yeah, he started crying, man. That's a weak nature too, man. Okay? And he cried bitterly. And that's 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 you see that now. You see that now. This man's kingdom going down. America's falling. They money system about to collapse. Alright? And this upcoming year, it's about to collapse. Okay? They starting to uh, lose their jobs. They starting to work these mediocre jobs with you Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, which they thought they would never be doing that because in their mind they thought they was better than you. Now they have to work with you. And they hating that, man. I work with I work with this Edomite. They was they was gonna fire him because he's lazy. Plus he he be filling up on his girl at, at the job inappropriately, because it's a time and a place, man. If you got a woman. And supposedly you working with her, you you know if you want to deal with her, you deal with her off the clock, not in front of everybody. This 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 eating mic rubbing on this woman's breasts and her ass in front of everybody, man. So the the girl she she feeling embarrassed, so she in a position of power now. She wanna they was gonna plan on firing this dude. He said if he get fired, he was gonna call the whole uh, department. The, the deportation department on on the um the restaurant and get it uh inspected and basically get it shut down if he loses his job mind you this is a, a basic job man this ain't no one of these corporate jobs he can easily go get him another low paying job but he had that weak nature now if jake lost their job they'd be like oh fuck it well i go get me another job or i get me a hustle that shows that you so-called white people go back to Esau. Because when you lose that, what you thought you, you deserve, you start crying and stuff, man. 
all bitterly like a